So I've been thinking about strength, man. Strength, might, the power to fight. Is it money, authority, a cool job, a ton of likes? <laughs> okay, okay. Let's keep it simple. I want to be strong. Can you believe it? We got self-driving cars. The time's coming, we'll be taking rockets to Mars. And yet you still got folks out there using their fists and bodies to seek strength. Yeah, I hear you, man. We're all a bunch of fools. But, you know, if you want to know about strength, you just got to get to it. We fighting fools are all getting to it on the streets. Any recruit? Kids, take a breather. Welcome. This is Buckler Security Services. I'm Luke, the coach around here. You're here for basic training, right? Okay, let's get you measured up. Say, you're photogenic. Oh, righty. Well, that should about wrap up your enrollment. Again, you can call me Luke. We're just coach. Okay, then. Hope you're ready to begin. First, let's go over the basics. All right, that about covers the basics. Kind of boring, right? <laughs> I knew it. That's how the basics are. Simple and boring. But remember, even the biggest rockets need a stable launching pad for takeoff. Or else they're just gonna crash and burn. You get me? Coach, how is any of that gonna help him handle this? Gonna be the type to jump before you think? But coach! That was the kind of situation I want to learn to deal with! You're not here to punch bags either, right? Hmm. Ah, right. This is Bosch. He signed up with the same regiment you are. Both of you are my trainees, and you joined at the same time. So play nice, okay? Coach, we both came here looking for strength. If both of us are trying to find that strength, sooner or later, one of us is going to get there first. What happens to the other person then? We all know that nobody's going to be friends after that, so why bother pretending now? Ah, oh, Bosh, my man, that's a really tough question. You gotta know what strength means to you before you go looking for it. You go looking for the wrong things, and you really might end up in that situation someday. But you know what? You can cross that bridge when you get to it. You two are still my plucky little trainees. Listen to what your coach says, and put your hearts into your training. Focus on that.
All right. Okay, let's get back to business. You wanted something more practical, right? Well, practicality comes in many forms. But if you want to start off on the right foot in this city... Hit the streets! So, you two check out the city, see the sights, rack up some wins, and then you come back with the confidence to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with your lovable coach. Guess that practical training paid off in spades. Am I right? If you want to make it in this world, you gotta do what you can. Grind like crazy, not let up. Not for a second. The road to the top is long. But you just gotta take it one step at a time. That first step you both took just now, it's something to be proud of. Man, you two are great students. You know what? You make a darn good team. I don't think it'd be the worst thing for you two to take on the world together. Together? Absolutely. Do some training like we did at the gym and around Metro City. Then, the two of you can go and travel the world. You can really get to know each other. Take on all comers. Seriously, you'll have a blast. I'm sorry, I can't. I, I need to be strong and I need to be it now. I'm not like you. I can't go around treating this like a game. Bosh, come on, coach. I'm done with the course. I got things I need to take care of. But you're right, this did give me some confidence. Thank you. Our only fight ended in a draw. Wish we could have had a rematch.
Li Fen, I'm disappointed in you. It's all that fooling around on your PC. I'm not fooling around. You're just way too good. Sorry for the trouble. I didn't mean to get you involved. I'm Chun Li. Is there something I can help you with? Come on, hurry! Damn it! You'll regret this! <gasps> what are you doing here of all places? Found them! Yeah! gotten a lot stronger. Our coach was right. If we stuck together, it really could have been something. I'm really sorry. I still have something important I need to do. Found him! Damn it, no time to explain. Hey, you! Stay away from me, got it? You didn't see me, just get out of here! Hey, you uglies! Over here! Get back here! You know that guy? You got something going on with him? <laughs> Man, whatever. That guy was carrying a bag that looks like this, right? Right? This is something very valuable that belongs to us. And he just stole it. So you're gonna tell your buddy to bring it back safe and sound. If you don't know him, then you're gonna have to do us a favor. You get me? I want you to find that guy and give us back what's ours. I really don't give a shit if you two are friends or not. We want that bag back and we want it now. So get it done or you're a pig slot. Now get your stupid ass moving. You understand? You ain't gonna have a moment of peace in this city until we get that bag back.
There's a freaking comedian here. Nice, huh? right, smart ass. We need to talk. Get up here. Stay away from me. I told you, I can't play around like you. Uh. to no one to quit. <laughs> Stop, kid. You're killing me here. And only one of us is allowed to do the killing. <laughs> it's a dog-eat-dog -dog world. <laughs> so, the hell's your deal? They told me to tenderize little Bosch here real good before bringing him in. But they didn't say anything about leaving his geeky friend alive. Wait! Leave him out of this! He just came to give me something I left behind. Right? Sorry for the trouble. mean it.
side, but now we're going to turn up the heat. <laughs> Do I see a frown out there? Nope, he didn't think so. All right. <laughs> you ready? Ready to Hey, you're here to enter the Novice League? Hmm, you're strong. But I wonder, what is it you fight for? <laughs> By the way, you aren't holding on to anything for someone, are you? I'm sure you're curious, but it's worthless to someone like you. Take my advice. You'd be better off forgetting about it. Today in Metro City, everyone, hmm. where the best rookie fighters have gathered at Mike Hagar Memorial Stadium, we'll be bringing you all the action from the novice running behind closed doors prior to the official opening of this new facility. Now then, hey kids and everyone else, it's your fave Eternity. I know Metro City has always had a penchant for fighting. But just look how fired up these fighters are. I wonder if any of them are up for a chat. The Novice League is all about finding new talent, which means everyone here is a first timer, right? Doesn't that make you nervous? No. Nerves are irrelevant. Losing isn't an option. Okay, I wasn't wrong about them being fired up. Now, like I said, this tournament is behind closed doors, so the seats are kind of lonely. But you're not gonna miss anything if you stay right here on my channel. On Futu, stay tuned. You wanted to know what it meant to be strong. 
So you just did some basic training and entered this tourney? Really? You're something else. <laughs> I guess that means you've still got a lot of room to grow. Is that right? Unfortunately, it looks like the main tournament's getting canceled, but on the bright side, we were still able to bring you some exciting fights. And there's one thing for sure. After dominating the novice, everyone's gonna be waiting to see what this rookie does next. And with that, thank you everyone out there for joining us for the Novice League Tournament. I bet Mike Hagar himself was flexing his pecs in approval. I'm Eternity. See you later, kids. And don't forget to sub and like. Safety first, bud. Wow, that was close.
don't touch anything here. You trip that alarm, and we're gonna have some more. Per protocol, the deck must be spotless at all times. Plus, my men are due back any time. Took this kid hostage. They twist your arm into doing another job for me. I was wrong about you, though. You're good. All right. I'll meet up with you later, okay? Wait! Help me! Get back here! 
Hey, that kid is nothing but a dirty little pickpocket. He's lying! I would never do such a thing! <laughs> Shut your mouth, brat. Let's go. <laughs> You dumb kid! Shit. What's with the racket? The hell's going on? Some mad gear pump trespassing. And stop calling me boss, okay, Chandy? It's Mr. Rudra. Understood, Mr. Boss Rudra. But you've got to call me Chandy Pop then. All my friends do. We'll talk later, okay? Who in the blue hell are you? And what are you doing on our turf? We got a real fighter on our hands here. He wants in on the nice Shao tournament. Hmm. Is that a fact? I tell the organizers we're sending one of our own to the tournament, and then Thrasher scrambles like an idiot and sends you here, huh? Hmm. I was gearing up for a good brawl, you know? Now we got ourselves a bona fide main event. We got the Crows versus Mad Gear. You go round up for the best. This has been a long time coming. We're gonna find out which one of us is worthy of repping Metro City. Tell Frasher to get ready. The Crows will be waiting. I sense your search for powerful fighters. <laughs> you won't be disappointed. to the grandest stage will be the Mad Gear representative and our special seated fighter. Although we can't say who exactly they represent.
I thought if I could beat you up, maybe break a bone or two, then that would be enough to make you give up on the tournament. But you've gotten strong, you know? Much stronger than I have. I'm fine. I'm not dead. Not just yet. You know, when you said you were seeking strength, despite having no real need to do so, I just didn't get it. Honestly, I thought you were a complete idiot. But I guess... Maybe you had the right idea all along. Remember when we decided to check out the city? Kicking butt and eating pizza? I really enjoyed it. But I can't play around like that. Impressive belt, isn't it? No intrinsic material value, nor artistic value, for that matter. The true value of a champion's belt is found instead in the person recognized to be worthy of wearing it. Surely you must agree. Ah, my apologies. My name is Johan Petrovich. I happen to work here. In fact, I'll have the honor of presenting this belt to the winner of the tournament. Martial Arts Tournament is now underway. Please welcome our fighters. This tournament pays tribute to the almighty Savalha. For this fifth running of our tournament, the best of the best have once again gathered from around the globe. Show us your fighting spirit.
Oh boy, even the fans are getting into that fight spirit. Wow! This traditional dance represents a prayer for the tournament's success. Mr. Johan Petrovich of the Tournament Committee will present the belt to the winner. Which of these warriors will take victory and earn Sir Volhall's blessing? It's sure to be a fierce competition. I want, I must win it at any cost. I need to defeat him. I don't want to tell you to forfeit, but my body's been modified. It's reaching its limit. I can't control it. What do you need in the arena? I won't have any idea it's you. Isn't quite how I pictured us settling our draw. <laughs> the fifth Zavalhal martial arts tournament has finally come to its dramatic conclusion. Let's have a big round of applause for all our contestants who gave their fights everything they had. And now, we offer up this victory to Zavala. Presenting the champion's belt to our winning fighter, tournament committee member, Mr. Johan Petrovic. It would be my honor. However, I feel it's an honor that would be better entrusted to our wonderful dancer here.
The fifth Savoy Hall Martial Arts Tournament has finally come to its dramatic conclusion. Let's have a big round of applause for all our contestants who gave their fights everything they have. And now, we offer up this victory to Savoy Hall. Presenting the champion's belt to our winning fighter, Tournament committee member, Mr. Johan Petrovic. It would be my honor. However, I feel it's an honor that would be better entrusted to our wonderful dancer here. Congratulations. You have defeated me. <laughs> and now what? What does this victory represent to you? Justice. Strength? The end of something? Or... The beginning? And now what? None of this means anything at all.
mess. That's about all I can say right now. So, that's it for your journey? Yeah, I figured. Still got unfinished business to take care of, right? That's how it goes. Hey, I know it's rare, but let me say something inspirational. Coach like. When you go looking for strength, it's not like a game. This journey doesn't have a real ending. For you, for me, for everyone. We're all walking down an endless path. I'll see you around. Thank you.